Oh hey, good afternoon. Ron here with Precision Sail Loft doing a new sail walk around for a very nice uh, looking sail here. This is a 150 Genoa uh, furling Genoa for a CS30 and this is done in uh, CDX laminate. So uh, I recommend this sail to a lot of our kind of high-end cruisers or high-performance cruisers. This is a very robust material. Uh, it's going to last a really long time. You can flake it, you can furl it, you can do pretty much anything you could do with a Dacron sail, uh, but it is laminate, so it's got a much better performance, a lot less stretch, and it's going to hold sail shape for a really long time into the future. So let's take a quick little walk around here. Um, we'll start down here in the tack, and we'll quickly just kind of focus in on how this tack is going to attach. So we've got a good solid uh, webbing there that'll attach to your shackle. Um, we're gonna, I'm going to flip some corners over here so you can take a look at the radial. Uh, the CDX is in a radial uh, design. Hopefully that comes through okay in the uh, video. And what this customer has chosen to do is put uh, white Dacron on as UV covering. So solid white sail, looks really nice. We've put a couple of hash marks here, or furling marks. So you can keep track of where you're furling, uh, what wind speeds, that kind of thing. And so we'll walk over here, take a look at the clue corner. And so a really nice leather clue corner here with a good size press ring. And let's just flip this over so we can take a look at this corner a little bit better. It's not covered in the Dacron. So these are the radial corners. Notice that it comes out in that, in that radial starburst uh, fashion. Uh, we can really just kind of see the Stitching on the on this side is the the patchings on the other side, but that's okay. Give you an idea We've got the foot and leech lines uh, Underneath the velcro patch here, which keeps everything nice and hidden away Also protects your boat from any scratching from cleats and that kind of thing um, So here we go walking up the uh, leech and we'll get up uh, as you can see the white on white looks really cool and as we kind of walk on up here, we'll stop at the head and we can take a look at it. And what I want to do is actually, I'm going to pick this up and, and give it a couple of uh, shakes. And so you can get a kind of an idea of how heavy this material is and how uh, strong it's going to be. So, so nice solid material, really like it. This is one of my favorite materials out there. Just going to move this over so we can take a walk down. But that should give you a little bit of an idea of the weight of this. Um, let's just take a quick little walk down the left here. Nice draft stripe. And this will give a better idea of uh, the triradial. You can see where the, the panels are vertical here towards the top. And then as we kind of come down into the belly of it, in the midsection, this is where it breaks off into the, into the tack corner. And over there into the clue. So that's the tri radial design, excellent for sail shape and uh, really, really nice design here. I'm going to focus in a little bit so you can kind of get an idea of the material itself. See if the camera will focus in on it. But you can see the taffeta type material on top of a laminated material. Much better than Dacron, guys, and for the price, uh, if you are a performance cruiser, this is the one for you. Uh, lasts a good long time, holds sail shape, and uh, much better performer than a Dacron sail.